All right, ladies and gentlemen, you um, see this? This is all I brought. All right, bingo. That's all you really need, though, honestly. Some of the best players use their hands to play video games. All right, you know, that's what you start with. Every every great player <laughs> starts with their hands. I don't know. Some of you be playing with their mouths, you know? That's pretty fucking cool. I, I haven't seen that. That's that's uh, <laughs> that's a different type of game. Who is it? I think it's like some League of Legends player who plays with their mouth or something. Oh, like wow. That. Oh, no, Street Fighter play. He plays with his mouth. Okay, okay. Very cool. I dig that. Hit. Oh, wow. Definitely. I'm, I'm going to hop off this commentary. Let me see if I can get somebody else over. Hey, hey, hey. There you go. I found another commentator. Right, cool. It's your turn, man. It's your turn, man. Your turn. Yeah, yeah no, 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 just, just. There you go. All right. You, you got to get into it. All right. I'm gonna pass to you the headset. He's on, man. What's up? We got a new guy on here. All right. What's up? My name's uh, Sterling Silver. I'm a Pokemon trainer main. And okay. I am a Smash Bros. Alcohol. Oh, sorry. I'm not here. <laughs> um, Don't worry. I'm also an alcoholic. <laughs> All right. Who do we got here? We oh, got, it looks uh, like Shulk versus Asina. Oh, Nico. Oh, Nico. Holy crap! I heard a lot about him on stream, actually. Yeah, Nico and is Nico. quite good. I uh, faced him in SoCal Chronicles, mm -hmm. and he wiped the floor with me. Ouch. He's able to use those Monandos so solidly. And let's see. I mean, the way Shulk is right now, he's some people are saying he's top tier. Just the way he, like the way he can be everything he wants to be, right? Yeah, absolutely. He does seem like a, you need a high learning curve to really use Dude, him to wow. the highest of potential, but yeah, he is. Quite good, especially Nico's stroke right here. Uh, what did you think Nico does well against compared to other jokes in the, uh, I guess, in, just in the game so far? Well, I honestly I don't know too much about the other strokes, but I can just speak to uh, personally Nico's ability to combo with the speed mm -hmm. and just his mobility in general. His ability to switch between the Monandos extremely uh, quickly to like switch his shield if he's in the middle of a combo or if he, oh, yeah, absolutely see that smash Monando can kill with that up B yeah, so soon. Up. That was a great up B from him. Oh my god. Backslash player one. Dead. Uh, he's only his greatest weakness himself. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. But uh, yeah. Nico can approach with those fares and those nares really I've well. Seen it, yeah. Mm -hmm. He knows how to place that thing still seems really well. Absolutely. But we've seen his no stock though, right? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, yeah, to take a stock on him is definitely an accomplishment for kicking him in right here. Mm -hmm. oh, I love that name. <laughs> <laughs> That's excellent. With that with that uh that sword Lucina has Definitely adds her assets there. Mm -hmm. Able to get in against his sword. His is longer though, so. His is longer, but uh, I'm assuming it comes with certain. That's, never yeah. mind. That's the no one wants to win that way. Oh. Not even that way. Especially on the top players. They want to get the decide. most out of the game they can. You know about Kika Man? I actually know. I haven't uh, haven't had the chance to meet him yet. I bet he's a pleasure though. Mm -hmm. I believe so as well. Yeah, I'm oh, sorry, I didn't think I'd introduce myself. My name is Keanu. Keanu, very nice to meet you. Yeah, I just, uh, this is my first tournament. Oh, this is your first tournament, actually. Yeah. <laughs> this must be daunting commentating on your first tournament. Yeah, huh? a little bit. Um, <laughs> so this is my first time commentating as well. they just like, hey, come here. I didn't know they were just kind of random. I thought it would just be cool to come in. They said, hey, you need a spot to come commentate. Yeah. I'm like, well, I'll just pick you out of the crowd. It looks like we got a Marth Ditto right now. Oh, Steve, you're right. Mm -hmm. oh, Maybe cool. I was not expecting that. I know Nico was a Marth main back in the Smash 4 days, mm. so he definitely has skill sets coming in this match. Who's in Shulk though? Why do you think he switched over? Just because? Probably because just to do the Ditto match. I mean, Good night, part, winning is part of the fun, but having fun is also part of the fun. So. Very true, very true. Marth is his notable exception is that he's going to be Tipper. His best attack is going to be Tipper, right? He's yeah. Space. Absolutely. And coming from Shulk, that's a natural spacing character so you can only expect that from uh, Nico right here and Kikoman as well. Both experienced sword characters, clearly. They seem to be pretty even right now. Kikoman is proving himself to be a little bit oh, he gets that was a heavy that. back air right there. That's fine, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Nothing's decided yet clearly. Ooh, there oh it is. My God, that fair can kill. Ass. That fair can kill. Yes, it can. That was a deep ass edge guard. Mm -hmm. Boy, who has a curse on stream? <laughs> I don't think I didn't ask that before. I, I, I don't think they Goodness can. Goodness gracious. Okay. Alright. So that that uh, side B is going to come out probably a lot. It's, That's yeah. Nair? I, I believe so. And it has the vertical range to really counter aerial approaches. Mm -hmm. And just because of how fast it is, how well it can catch people. It's a great tool by all the so people who have it. Oh yes, I, I think there's one kid who doesn't have side B. I think it's Ike had, has a different side B. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, let's see. Mm -hmm. Of course, Robin. I wouldn't really count Robin as one of the Fire Emblem short characters, however. 
he's kind of, oh, they're kind of unique. Yeah. So kind of like a, a Ness, Ness sword character. Ness nice. had a sword. Yeah, I can totally see that. Nice. So, yeah. <laughs> I, I doubt he's regretting changing from Shulk, but Kukuman definitely has the advantage right now. I think he's going to be a good show for him for his money. He's keeping Absolutely. up with him even though it's about two more. So, mm -hmm. I think it's fine that he's just did the ditto. Yeah. Plus, and he also, always has Shulk to fall back on as well. Very much so. Which means, well, consider it this way. Maybe he doesn't download the next one, so he just pick up the next one, so he's going to do the next game. Yeah. Maybe Steam Elm? I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Another dancing lane. Just get him out of the way. Right? Oh, wow. Oh, Surprised I caught him. For that. Yeah. Jeez. Oh, Joker's doing a good work. Joker's really walling him out there. Oh, he's able to get back on stage. Yep. Goes from the down tilt. Out there. More down tilt. Everyone just down tilt him. Yeah. Coming from melee, I definitely like seeing the Mars uh, dash dance down tilt <laughs> neutral <laughs> game. I see it evolve from, like, from uh, melee to uh, ultimate so far? Uh, actually, speaking from Marth, I can speak from experience there. Uh, he's definitely different. I don't like using Marth in this game because the sword's shorter, mm -hmm. but he definitely has a lot of the same strengths as melee Mars. The disjoint, the speed, yeah, his ability to edge guard, all supreme. I've heard a lot of people say that no one's ever been great on melee Mars because like he's like the ultimate sword. Player. Yeah, I, I would I would agree with him there. He just has his sword is easily the longest disjoint. Oh, there it is, finished. And there it is. One one. And there it is. Taking it to game three. Or is this oh, winner's final? Is this the best of five? To lose. No, it's two out of three. Last oh, two out of three. Also two three well. Okay. Yeah. So they got one more chance out of this. All right. Bring it home. I'm gonna run back. Did you see Pokemon Stadium was the repick there? Yeah, it was Pokemon Stadium. Um, I'm not, I don't have a lot of experience with it, but I've just seen only people kind of like, oh, what do you want? Like, oh, I'll just pick this. Like, yeah, sure. that's definitely the most common gentleman's pick there. And another Pokemon Stadium again. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't think it's music for What's up with that? Uh, <laughs> I, <laughs> I guess they don't think it's necessary. That's fine. I guess it'd be kind of distracting to be like, oh, we're hearing the music. Also, we're playing the commentary. Also, yeah. there's two or something. You have to multi-tax. If you're listening to the music and watching the game here. Very much so. That, you see Joker switching to that Buster Monando, I believe that's the name, to rack up as much damage as he can as Martha does have the percentage lead on him right now. That was an excellent dare to fair sports match oh there. Yep. Jeez. Trying to get their jump on him. <laughs> Kikuman's definitely carrying the momentum from his last game here. He might be uh, a little salty. <laughs> <laughs> that would be understandable. It definitely helps that his uh, tipper helps in his spacing there. If he does catch him with the farthest extent of his reach, he does do extra damage there. Yeah. And oh my God. raw fare from uh, Smash Mondos. Enough to kill. Oh, a sick yeah, parry. Parry. Oh, oh. Parries will change the game so much once people know how to do them, but yeah, you don't really too. see that yet that to a high extent. Uh, SF3, mm. yeah. I'm not super familiar with other fighting games, but I can Im I can imagine just being able to stop your opponent, getting a move in, really it valuable. Is, it's pretty Ooh. Oh my god. Oh. Jeez, that's the advantage of Pokemon Stadium for gimping characters. Holy Much harder to get out of that. I can believe that. Holy cow. Here comes the aerials from Nico again. Jeez, all of all like of almost lagless. Yeah, that's because all of Shulk's uh short hop aerials auto cancel in this. They didn't in four, which made him a lot slower character. Oh, Not yeah. only because of four's engine, but because just he just general. had so much lag on the end of all his moves. But as you can see, back air, neutral air, fair, all auto cancel. Boom. Absolutely. Comes out the Buster again. Purple. Mm -hmm. I'm, my question is, how is the DI affecting his combos there? I feel like if Kikuman DI'd outwards, he would have been able to get cut out of those uh, air trains there. Possibly. He may not know how. Oh, oh don't see that combo. Never mind. Oh, oh boom. Okay. Christ the That's Lord, the Nico special. Like a pterodactyl. All right. I think uh, I actually got to go right now. My uh, my caravan's heading out. We all got uh, busted out of bracket pretty oh. early. I got a sweet Prana plant. 